Hello guys, it's Cassini here, and now I'm going to teach you how to install the Breeze mod for Disney Infinity 3.0. First, what you're going to want is to have Continuum Mod Manager completely installed and, and hooked with the, with the integration and set, and set up your game. My game is already set up with Continuum, so yeah, which is really good. So now what we're going to go do is download the mod. So here. I'll, I'll, I'll open Google Drive because that's where I prefer downloading it. It's probably much easier than Nexus Mods, but um, you can still download it from Nexus Mods if you want. But then you're going to click download. It's too big, but you can still download it anyway. I'm not going to be downloading this because I already have it downloaded to my computer. But that's what you're meant to do. Anyway, so when that's done downloading, you're going to click this add mod button. And then you go down here and then you find the mod We're right here this process does take a hot minute so you will have to wait which but it will work it don't think it's soft locked it will work I'll be back when it does 75 years later okay now that that's done you should see this icon right here so we're gonna click it and and there's an install button over here but first, you can, what you can do is you can click options and tick the um, fuck with these. So these are on default on by default, and if you uncheck them, uh, they will add them to the game. So if you uncheck the light FX characters, it will add them to your game, and if you uncheck the premium Elsa textures, it will add them to your game. I like to have them. I like to have them on, so I'll leave them unchecked. You can also look at the credits. There's a lot of people. And they pretty much deserve it. So, yeah. And anyway, we're going to go click install. This will also take a minute, but it's not as long as the other one. Which is good. And don't worry if it looks on if it looks stuck on um, st up step 20. It is not stuck. It just, there's a lot of stuff. Okay, and now it's done installing. Now you can go ahead and play the and play the mod. But first, I should let you know this right now, that this is very important step. So because of how the mod manager screws it up, um, because of how big the mod is, as it's almost one gigabyte unzipped, it um it just the mod manager doesn't like it. So it sometimes can accidentally erase it. So um, what, you, what you should do is check this little box and then uninstall it. So, and then if it, if it actually goes away, you, don't, you won't have to reinstall your game and Continuum. But if it does go away when it's in available for install, what you should do is go to, go to your app data, Continuum Mod Manager, Data, Mods, and then, and then whatever Breeze version you're on, and then just delete it. And then you can re-add it and then play your game again. So I hope that was a good tutorial. Well, and anyway, have fun with the mod. Bye.